in Bayou Black, first time captain Brock Terrio and his deckhand Aaron Lee begin their season. At just 19 years old, they're out to prove themselves as the next generation of gator hunters. I'm 19. I play college baseball uh, growing up down here in the south. I definitely have a passion for the outdoors to hunt and to fish, and that was planted into me by my dad, my grandpa, you know, all the father figures and role models that I had growing up. I like upholding the tradition that they had. And to make them proud, you know, it would bring nothing but joy to me. And that's my main goal for this year. Brock has gator hunted his whole life, but this is his first season as captain of his own boat. Going out there as my own captain this year, it's a whole different sense of responsibility. I don't have backup. I got me and Aaron. If something is to go wrong, we got to figure out how to get it done. I'm super nervous, but I'm super excited at the same time. Ready for it? Let's get it. Bang, baby. Helping out Brock this season is his lifelong friend and hunting partner, Aaron Lee. I trust Brock as a captain. Uh, growing up, we've, we've ridden boats our entire life together. And to alligator hunt, that's a whole different story. You know, it's, it's, a, lot, it's a lot more dangerous. Being young, like we said, we have to show that we're man enough to do it. The young hunters look to start their swamping career off with a bang. No alligator. But today, they're facing the same problems as their fellow swampers. There's nothing on it. Oh, man. Not even small ones, dude. What the hell? We don't got an uh, alligator. Oh. Faced with a disastrous first day, new Captain Brock decides to turn to his most valuable resource, his family. You know, the gators like them white birds. Tie a white rag right above your bait. They flood us in the breeze. Like them big wild birds. Acting on Papa's sage advice, the young swampers spent their morning rebaiting lines with white rags. White flag, white rag. By essentially creating egret decoys, the boys hope to lure the gators out of hiding. For my Papa to give me a tip like that, you know, I'm 100% confident in it. It's not scientifically proven, but you know, it's cage proven. We got a line coming right here. This might be a good one. This is a, uh, this is Papa's white rag. Three shaker. <laughs> That's what we need to turn it there. Hang on tight. Hurry up, get him. You missed, you missed, you missed. Watch out, whoa. He's a monstrosity of an alligator. How you missing? Come on the right side, come on the right side. Hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry up, hurry up. Come on. Papa's white rag, boy. Look at Papa's white rag. That's what I'm talking about. This 11-foot gator weighing over 400 pounds is a great start for the young swampers' careers and a source of family pride for rookie Captain Brock. To see that big alligator pop his head up and he's got that white flag chilling on his nose, the first thing that popped in my head, I was like, my Papa, he delivered. Papa's white flag got us a what, 11 foot gate? Without a doubt. You can't complain with that, bro. You know, it's the first day. You can't make a big alligator bite your line. Sometimes you got to work for him. You got to figure out ways to go get that alligator. And, uh, you know, I've seen my grandpa pull in big gators my whole life. So uh, I'll try any little trick that my grandpa gives me. Come on down. Go up to the tree. I'm going to pull us that way. Before he goes crazy, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hey, pull him up slow. Right, right, get him. You ready, you ready? Get another, get him, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Oh, he's rolling, hurry up, hurry up. Whoa. Watch, 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 watch. Oh, oh he's burning. Oh, Get him, you better get him, get him. That's 
a good one. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Not bad for some 19 year old. I can remember my grandpa telling me stories about them alligator hunting. They didn't even use guns. They used sticks and machetes to kill the alligators. They go and they go find them in the holes. And so it was just a good feeling, you know, using one of my papa's tips and pulling big gators in the boat. That white flag work, dude.